Hey, what's up, YouTube land? Uh, just hanging out. Uh, I'm just gonna do another uh, movie review. Uh, listen to the new, the new uh, Ghost album. Um, it's called like Prequel. Is that how you say it? Prequel. Uh, I'm about to do a um, review on it. It's actually the first time I'm listening to it. I've actually heard Rats before. Now I'm listening to it right now. Uh, sounds really cool. Sounds like the production's a little bit better. Uh, the songs sound a little catchier, but I mean, it sounds like Ghost. Um, but uh, like I said, probably my next video, I'm probably gonna do a post, uh, review on this album. But very cool, very cool band. For a while, I didn't I didn't really like get into them, but now I, you know I really really like them. Very different, very breath of fresh air in the metal world. Very very cool. Uh, album sounds pretty good so far, so uh, check it out. But the um, the uh, movies I was gonna review uh, today or tonight, um, or it's actually a set of movies I was gonna review. Um, you know, like I said, I'm a big horror fan, but you know I like the classic horror too. Um, sometimes I think the classic horror is better than. The new stuff, this the atmosphere and this the sets and the actors that, you know, some of the actors are <clears throat> due to train, so I think they put better performances. And this set, this kind of this box set I just got is kind of, um, the makeup is, is pretty I iconic. If you go to a um, Halloween store around Halloween, they still use this as this character. And uh, I'm talking about the uh, Frankenstein box set, the complete collection um, of the Universal movies. They just got eight movies in here on Blu-ray. Um, been wanting this for a while, I finally got it. Um, some of these I haven't seen. Of course I've seen Frankenstein, I've seen The Bride of Frankenstein, and I've seen um, Frankenstein Meets the Wolfman, but some of these I haven't seen, like The Son of Frankenstein, I haven't seen. The Ghost of Frankenstein, I haven't seen. House of Frankenstein, I haven't seen. House of Dracula, I haven't seen. And Abbott and Costello Meet Frankenstein, I actually haven't seen those. So it's gonna be cool to kind of watch them. Very cool. Um, watch a couple, so far the, uh, the picture looks great. Um, since it's the first time on Blu-ray, so that's that's pretty cool. Which some of these have been on Blu-ray before. I don't know why they said that. Maybe some of these, maybe the other ones. But uh, Frankenstein actually having another box set on Blu-ray. But um, and, and Bride of Frankenstein, I do have a Blu-ray too. But um, pretty cool. Um, he's got the old movie poster on that one. Pretty cool. Um, like I said, um, they kind of put two, even three, on like one Blu-ray. I don't really like that, but um, I don't know, but the, I'm sure the picture, I haven't got around to those, but I'm sure the picture looks great. Um, I remember Frankenstein Meets the Wolfman is the first time I saw Frankenstein and, and the Wolfman just kind of in, in a movie and they were fighting. I only saw the end, the last uh, 10 minutes, and I think that's the last 10 minutes you like, need to see. It's the best part of the movie, them fighting and the castle's exploding and it's being flooded you know, while they're fighting in uh, Frankenstein's laboratory. Very cool. When I was a kid, that just totally blew my mind. I thought that was so cool. But um, I'm really, I, like I said, I've been wanting this for a while. They have like a Dracula one, uh, Wolfman one, uh, Creature from the Black Lagoon, uh, The Mummy, and uh, The Invisible Man. So I'm gonna try to collect all these. Um, I don't think The Invisible Man and Creature are all, all on Blu-ray. I think they're just on DVD. I know Dracula's got his own box set. Wolfman does, and I think Pitch of Black Lagoon, um, The Mummy, and I, Mummy might be on Blu-ray too, and I think Invisible Man only on DVD that I found, and I got this off of Amazon. So, very cool. Like I said, I love these old horror movies. I just think, this the atmosphere, and this, I think the sets are cool. Everything's real, everything's practical. And, you know, for some of these, you know, like the very first one's 1931, you know, this the, it just looks really, really cool, very theatrical, and of course, it, it goes all the way from 1931 to 1948, which is really, really cool. Um, but, uh, can't wait to watch some of these, um, like I said, I mean, I just think these are some better than, you know, some of the, uh, the newer horror movies, you know, I don't think these get old. I was watching them with my wife, and, uh, she said, uh, oh, this looks so bad, but, um, I don't know, I, I love it, you know, I think it's so cool. And, uh, of course, um, um, Willis Karloff plays Frankenstein and, uh, the Fr Frankenstein and Brian Frankenstein. I don't know if he plays him and Son of Frankenstein, I'm gonna have to watch it. But I know uh, Bullish Call, or I'm sorry, yeah, um, Frankenstein meets the Wolfman. I know um, Bella Lugosi plays Frankenstein, and they asked him to play Frankenstein the original. I think he turned it down, and uh, he went on to play, of course, Dracula. And uh, I, I like his Frankenstein. His Frankenstein's really cool. Of course, uh, Juan Janey Jr. plays um, the original Wolfman, which is cool. But um, like I said, I love these movies. Um, 
Uh, I just can't wait to collect all of them. It just, being a horror fan, I like to collect all genres, you know. I just I love the new stuff, and I like this stuff, too. Like I said, I said I didn't like, you know, I like this better than the new stuff, but I still like the new stuff. But um, if you haven't seen this and you're a big Universal movie horror uh, monster fan, definitely check this out. Very, very cool. They did a really good job. They usually have it at Walmart on Halloween, but uh, as soon as like Halloween's over, they sign out, they kind of get rid of it. But um, I got this off of Amazon, but I'm I'm really happy. It looks cool. It, it looks really neat. Um, cover is kind of like he's kind of coming at you. It's kind of 3D, which is really cool. But like I said, if you're a big horror fan like I am, I like all genres of horror. Definitely check it out. So cool, guys. Cheers.